Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. For those of you who are new, I am Miranda Marie. For those of you who are not new and you are returning to the channel, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the channel. So I hope everyone is having a great week so far. Today is Friday Eve. So I'm just coming today with a little, I guess, day in the life, but day in the life after work um is that such a thing <laughs> but i literally just cut clocks out of work not too long ago um i'm actually working from home this week so i figured you know what i said i was gonna try and upload at least once a week twice if possible so we're just gonna get this content going but I hope everyone is having a great week so far. Like I said, it is Friday Eve. We are almost there. Payday is around the corner for some people. You know, hopefully those who are off the weekend, if you have plans, drop them below and let me know what you guys are doing. Because so far, I don't have any plans. Like, I do, but I don't. I actually have a couple patients that I have to see this weekend. So that's going to take up at least the morning portion of my day. But for the afternoon and the evening, like, I don't have no plans. So what are y'all doing? Like, drop down below. What, what What's going on this weekend? What are y'all doing in y'all's neck of the woods? But, um, yeah, like I said, this is just a little day in my life. Um, after work, usually after work, I just kind of <sighs> breathe and woosah from the day. I make sure I get all my stuff in order so I'm ready for the next day. That way I'm not scrambling to get stuff ready even though I'm working from home. Trust me, it's easy to get lost in the sauce and you look up, you like, oh my God, it's time to clock in and you ain't got nothing ready. So I like to kind of just do that. Um, once I clock out, I'm sitting here at my desk now. Um, because I do have certain stuff hung up, I'm not gonna show my complete desk. Um, and things laid out, but it's just pretty much a little desk, has my printers, has my pens, markers, things like that. Um, I did have to order me a new USB cord, which came today. Um, I wanted to get an extra one for both of my printers, actually. One printer primarily stays here, which is actually my own personal printer. But then I do have a printer that my job provided for me. And um, sometimes when I travel, depending on how long I'm gone or what type of business I'm on, I will take it with me because I might be somewhere where the hotel is too far to get what I need or I can't print it out the hotel ahead of time because I'm not sure what I might need. Um, Especially when you're dealing with so many different providers, like different providers want different things. Some people you can kind of stick to the regular schedule or have certain forms, you know, pre-printed already and that'll be what they need. But then there's other doctors who will call something out and you'll just be like, the one thing I don't have printed and that's what you need. So um, I wanted to be able to at least keep one cord here and then take one cord of course with me so if ever it's lost or one goes out or whatever the case may be I have an extra cord um, for either one of my printers since my other one is primarily here I don't worry about it as much um, actually since I've gotten the one from work I barely even use the one at home but like I told you in the previous video if you were watching the previous video that if y'all hear that sound my air just kicked on so and I'm sitting right by one, I'm sitting literally like right by one of the main big events. So if you hear that noise, that's what it is. But um, if you watched my last video, you know that I told you that I have a couple things in the works. So the printer will be getting used very soon and more frequently than usual. But that was one of the things that I did get today. And then, um, I'm also getting ready to, which I'm a little bit late, but it's been so busy. I keep like a little calendar like this. I'm such a calendar planner person, like my personal phone, my work phone, my work laptop, my personal laptop, like all the calendars, reminders, tasks, like I have everything like in all of those. And then I also like to keep a little desk calendar um, instead of one of the real big ones, because like I said, I have so much stuff between personal stuff and work stuff. 
I just don't have a room for a big, big calendar. And I really don't want to hang, hang anything on the walls because, you know, you live in an apartment, you hang stuff, you got to make sure you replaster all that stuff and get it done before you move. So I'm just like, I'm not doing all that. So I have a little desk calendar. You can get this from like, I think I got this from the Dollar Tree. Um, and I believe I got this. Where did I get this? I believe I got this the beginning of the year. Yes, I got this beginning of the year. I really uh, originally got it for school, but then I found a different kind of calendar that I like for school that I can keep in my binder. And then I just decided to switch this over and use it for like everyday type stuff. So if you look closely, I had a couple days where I was like, PCO, things like that. And um, I like to put important stuff on the calendar. So like when I'm going to be out traveling like this week and I need to add my next um, my next couple um, events that I'll be working. So I can put those on the calendar and then like any PCO that I have, any meetings, anything like that, I like to put it on here. So then when I look up at it, I can be like, oh, that's right. Just in case if it hasn't popped up on my phone or if I haven't looked at my calendar on my laptop yet. So like I said, you can get this from Dollar Tree, literally a dollar. They have different sizes. I also like it because it has like the little thing at the bottom. So it literally can just like, if you look on the side, it just unfolds and you can just sit it right down there. Um, this is a year calendar, so December will be the last of this one, and then I'll have to go get another one, but definitely comes in handy. Um, I also have like a planner, planner too, but I believe that's actually in my car. Because I think my, yes, because my work bag is still in my car, so my actual planner, planner is in my car. Um, really, that's it for the most part. Um, I'm about to go ahead, mark down my calendar, get those together. Um, make sure I put my USB cord up. When I tell you when they delivered my stuff today, they scared the mess out of me and I was in the middle of a telehealth. And I jumped so bad. <laughs> Even the patient was like, are you okay? I was like, I'm so sorry. I was like, somebody just knocked at my door and it just threw me off. Or somebody knocked outside and just threw me off. So yeah, but um, I did get that. I also got this little, um, this uh, little case here, it's like a, it's supposed to be a sunglass rack. It's like a little clear thing in a couple pieces. I had ordered it before and when it came, it was broken like in pieces. So I was just like, um, I'm gonna need for y'all to get that together. So I really wanted to get it because I have so many sunglasses now and I just don't wanna like, just keep them laid out in certain places. Like some of them have cases. Some of them don't, so I was just like, okay, I'm gonna need for y'all to get it together. But for the most part, it's really simple. It's just two little pieces like this. I thought it was gonna be more than that. But, and then if you look here, it has like the little hitches on them. And I guess on here, if you look, it has like the little holes for the hitches to go into. Hitches, clutches, clutches, whatever, you know, hinges. There we go. That's so, <laughs> that sounds more like it. Can you tell I just got off of work? So we're going to pop it in there and see. Oh, yeah. Then you just slide it up. Slide it up. Okay. Oh, and then it just looks like that. It's like a little, a little sunglass tower. Oh. And actually, I have some of my little Blu-ray blockers right here. They're clear. I love these things. When I'm at work, I definitely have to. My braids are in the way. Thank God I haven't had to use them lately. My braids are really in the way. Oh, my God. And I got them braided, so I'm over here struggling. Okay, we're not going to worry about that because I'm literally struggling. But, uh, cute. Okay. So, that's what it looks like. Just a little clear. So it looks like I can fit about one, two, three, four, about five pair on there. So I'm gonna have to order some more of these because five ain't gonna be enough. Five's not gonna be enough for me. I'm gonna need some more. I'm gonna need at least three more. At least three more for now. So 
I'm about to order some more of those, but that's super cute. I have a little space in my closet where I can just sit them up at, so nice. I got this on, where did I get this from? It wasn't Amazon, it was Shein, Shein. I got this from Shein. That's where I got it from, because I was gonna say, I know it's not Amazon, but um, I got it from Shein. I think it was like, I wanna say it wasn't no more than three or four bucks. So that's what that was. But, um, and then I also, another little thing that I got, which I'm so, so excited about. Someone that I know is getting ready to um, get a uh, beauty line of theirs started up. So she sent me a little sample of the lip gloss and if you look here you can see the color but I'm actually wearing it now you probably can't tell but this is the color if you can see it I don't know if you can see it from the light that's the color let's see if I can swatch it that's what it looks like on my hand can see it and then like I said I do have it on my lips probably can't tell and that's what I love about it I'm the type of person I don't like really really bright bright lipsticks unless it's like a pretty pink or a red very rare do you see me think do you see me wearing red but sometimes I will but I do like that you can see the color the lighting in here is so off today I don't know what's going on but like I said, this is not gonna be a very, very long video. This is just something to just come on and just kind of let y'all know how I unwind at the end of the day. Um, like I said, I open a couple of packages that comes through. I get myself, um, my stuff ready for in the morning. Um, depending on what kind of day I really, really have, sometimes I will literally just clock out, breathe deep, uh, go get me a glass of wine and sit out on the patio and just really just breathe sometimes I might just play some music and just unwind um sometimes I might go to the gym it just really depends on how I'm feeling today today I got a lot of stuff to work on so I'm not going to do the gym today but I definitely will be in there tomorrow so maybe I will take y'all with me to the gym if I don't go to the gym I'm definitely going to work out so whether it's a gym workout or a home workout I'm definitely going to get a workout in so maybe I'll take you guys along with me on that but, like I said, short video, just a little check-in, day in the life after work. Um, let me know some of the things that you guys do at the end of your work day to just kind of unwind, relax from the day, just kind of, you know, woosa a little bit. Drop the comments below and let me know. But please make sure that you are subscribed to the channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell so that you know each and every time I upload a video. Please make sure that you go tell a friend to tell a friend to tell some more friends to come on and join and click that subscribe button so they can be a part of our gang. Until then, have a great, great Thursday. Have a great Friday Eve. And if I don't see y'all on Friday, have a great safe Friday and an even better weekend. But for now, bye.